Hello, Dolphin users. Now, this video will teach you how to install the DFLURE drivers with the latest advanced drivers prepared by Dolphin Data Lab. Now, let's start the video. So, this is the DFLURE hardware we have collected at this picture shows. So from this picture, we have understand that we can connect two USB devices to DFLURE, or sometimes we can connect USB flash drives or the external portable hard drives. So to use this DFLURE properly, the very first step for users is to download the latest software from the Dorfin user only forums and then users can simply install it. After installing the software, we can see one desktop icon called DFLC panel. We can open this DFLC panel. We can see that it's empty. This is because the drivers have not been installed. To get the channels here, we need to install the drivers. Now, this is the new DFLURE drivers. We can see that there are two types of drivers here. Drivers for the Windows 7, drivers for the Windows System 10. Now, my system is Windows 7, so I can open the Windows 7 drivers URE. We can see that this one is for the system 32 bit and this one is system 64 bit mine is this one 64 bit here we can see the drivers there is one program we can install directly pre install driver so we can simply click on it and we can see that DFLURE driver installation for Windows system 64 bit. Now we simply click install. Actually, all the drivers we have offered here are already signed ones. So users don't need to sign the driver. Even within the Windows 10, we can simply click Create. Then we can go to the Device Manager. From the Device Manager, we can see the unknown device here, other devices unknown devices. Now after we installing the drivers automatically, we go to my PC on the top, right click and scan for new hardware. Just wait. Because we have used this one-click driver installation program to install the drivers, so we just scan it and then wait until the drivers come up. So we can see there are two drivers which have been installed with this DFLURE hardware. So DFLURE, this is a device driver and here we can see the DFLURE system driver. So we can see there are two drivers here. 
That means the drivers have been installed successfully on this Windows 7 64-bit system. It is the same process users can use to install DFURE within the Windows 10 system. So after installing the drivers, we can go to the DFUURE in the C panel. We can see that the channels have been available here. So this is channel 0. This is channel 1. That means if users connect the USB devices to the channel 0, so users can open this channel and open TDP, then users can start the disk image or file extraction from these USB devices. So now it is, becomes very easy for all DFURE users to use the DFURE tools for data recovery. For new users, users can come to our product shop of Dorton Data Lab and select the necessary tools to work together with the DFOURE. Thank you for watching this video.